Richmond Mayor LeVar Stoney says he will propose pay increases for police officers in the upcoming budget. This comes after recent backlash over police pay in the city. 8 News reporter Alex Thorson joins us live in Richmond with this story. Alex. Well, Deanna, the city is down some 130 officers. The Richmond Coalition of Police says low pay is one reason to blame for that, but change could be coming this spring. Billboards like this one still standing in Richmond as police officer pay and staffing shortages become hot topics once again. It's so hard to do the job and the quality that we do it at with being down so many officers. Late last week, Police Chief Gerald Smith introduced new so-called violence interrupter positions. These individuals will be from the streets. There's no way to put it. These people will come with some baggage. Positions he first said would annually pay some $20,000 more than a starting police officer. It just was a slap in the face when there were homicide detectives and officers that have been here for 10, 15 years being paid less than that. Facing immediate backlash, city leaders said the chief's numbers were off. Officials later correcting themselves twice, eventually cutting the original starting salaries of $65,000 for violence interrupters in half. If the pay had stayed at $65,000 a year, I had officers here for over a decade say that enough was enough and they were going to quit policing. Today, Richmond Coalition of Police President Brendan Levy says RPD officers then got this email from Mayor LeVar Stoney, promising to advance a pay increase for officers during early March budget talks. Stoney's office would not expand on what he would propose. Our stance is that we need a brand new pay plan and it needs to be fully implemented July 1st. Anything besides that is falling short. And last year, the city actually shot down our cops pay plan proposal, instead invested in a pay study. I'm told we should see the results of that pay study sometime at the end of this month. I'm told about a week before we should expect Mayor LeVar Stoney to tell us what he thinks Richmond police officers should be making going forward. In Richmond tonight, I'm Alex Thorson, A News.